Hello, and welcome to the June Gas Leak. So, for those of you who don't know, every month, the uh, the gas team puts together a gas leak, a collection of all the daily gas puzzles from the month, into a PDF. And at the end of the PDF, there are bonus puzzles. So, this is bonus puzzle number one, called XV German Whisper Sudoku by Clover. Normal Sudoku rules apply. Along each green line, adjacent digits have a difference of 5 or more. Digits separated by an X sum to 10. Digits separated by a V sum to 5. Not all possible Xs or Vs are necessarily given. So what does that mean? Well, we have our green German whisper lines. And there's something to know about German whisper lines is that 5 will never go on a German whisper line. The reason is, is because the adjacent digits must have a difference of 5 or more. So if we try to differ 5 by 5 or more, we'll get 0 on the low end and 10 on the high end. That's not going to work for us. So what ends up actually happening is we get the digits 1 to 9 split by 5 into a set of low digits, 1, 2, 3, 4, and high digits, 6, 7, 8, and 9. Any of the low digits, when differed by 5 or more, will yield you one of these high digits, and differing any of these high digits by five or more will always yield you one of the low digits. What that means for us here is, for example, we have a two. This two is part of our low set. That means when we differ this by at least five on either side, we'll have high digits. Those high digits, when differed, will then give us low digits. So along this German whisper line, we'll have low, high, low, high, low as an alternating pattern there. And that's the same for any of the German Whisper lines that you see here. Then we have our XV clues. So, separate by an X, X the Roman numeral for 10 says that these two digits must sum to 10. That would be our pairs 1, 9, 2, 8, 3, 7, and 4, 6. For our Vs, V is the Roman numeral for 5. These digits must be the pairs 1, 4, or 2, 3, the pairs that sum to 5. And 5 is actually interesting because 5 will never appear on an X or a V, because it's too high for a V, and it would require another 5 across from it for an X. And the fact that not all possible Xs or Vs are necessarily given just means that even though there is no X here, this is allowed to be 4, and even though there is no V here, this is allowed to be 2 to form that pair. And that's it. Those are the rules. Let's jump right into it. All right, so how how do we want to start with this? Seven. Well, all right. Let's not be stubborn with this. Let's just pencil mark this. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna think too much about it. This has to be one two because seven right is too close towards the center, um, as in 5, to allow 3 or 4. Because if you try to differ 3 by 5 or more, you get 8, and that's too big. So the maximums here that we can have are a 1-2 pair, and that 1-2 pair yields us with 3-4 opposite to it. Either way, we need 9 here, because 9 is the only digit that can go next to a 4. Just like with 6, 6 is an extreme like 4. It is the closest to 5 that you can get, and you can only have a 1 next to a 6. So if we know a 4 has to go in one of these two cells, this has to be a 9, so we can even have a 4 in the first place. Then, this has to be a high digit. What high digit is going to be? What high digit is it going to be? Well, with this 3-4 pair here, we know it can't be 6, because that would be 6-4, and already we know it's not 7 or 9, which means it must be 8-2. The 2 sets the order, 1-2 here, and it tells us that this is for 3 as a result. This must be a high digit, it can't be 7, 8, or 6, so it must be 9 with 1. This must be a 1-4 pair to make 5. One, sorry, this has to be a two, three pair. It means this is eight or nine. 
if it's 8, this would be 2, which means it must be 9, 1. Then I guess we already knew that this v had to be a 1, 4, but the 1 gives us 1, 4 here. And then what low digit is this going to be? Because this is going to be high digit. The only low digit it can be is 3, which makes this 7. And then this is 8 or 9. I don't know which one. This has to be 8 and 9 pair. This has to be any of the low digits. 1, 3, 4. Obviously, it can't be 2. Hmm. Nine, three. Oh, it can't be 4 to be 6. So this has to be the high digit, and this has to be the low digit. So this is either 6, 7, or 8 with 4, 3, 2, respectively. Hmm. Ah. Could it be 6? Where would 6 go? We know that 6 has to go somewhere here, so this could never be 6, which means this can't be 4. 4, we have roping. 2, 3, 4. 2, 3, 4. 9, 1, and then this will be 7 or 8. This will be... 9, 9 has to go here. This is 7, 8. So this is the same 7, 8. Hmm. Can we do better? I'm not sure, actually. What is this? This is 3, 5, or 6. 5, 6. This can't be 5 or 6, which means it's 7 or 8, which means this is a 5, 6 pair here. We know that this is 5, 7, 8. And this is 5, 6, 7, 8. Then this here is going to be 5, 6, 8, 9. 8, 9. But we already know that this can't be 5 or 6 here. I don't know why I didn't just pencil mark the 8-9 pair. I'm just so used to uh, not pencil marking things anymore. 8-9. 6, 7, 8, 9. We actually have... Yeah, we actually have a quintuple here, which means this is a 1, 2, 3 triple. We know this can't be 2. This can't be 1. 2, 3. Ah, that sets our lows and highs, though. So this must be 2, 3, which means this can't be 3. These must be our high digits. This, because there's a 3 next to it, must be 8 or 9. It can't be 9, so it must be 8. Then could this be 3? No, then it would require a 9, so it must be 2 with six wait, with 7 here. Sorry. Then this is 3. 3 then requires 9 here. This is 1. This is 2. 9, 2, 1. So this is 3 or 4, 5, 6, can't resolve, 7, I should, uh, I should do my housekeeping, 5, 6, 8, and what, 4. Surprisingly, I don't have better information, ah, 9, 9, 8, 9, 8, Seven, eight. <laughs> Five, six, seven, I guess is just what we're missing across here. Seven. It's got to be something better. I'm like spending the time pencil marking over here, but I'm sure I should be able to do something with this, right? Seven, eight, three, five, six. What are we missing? One, two. Either way, this is low. This needs to be high. It can't be six because then you'd have double one. It can't be seven, can't be eight, so it must be nine. This can't be three, and if this was four, it would need double nine. So this must be one, and this is two, and this is one because of the two over here. Then this could be, oh, it actually, I completely missed the seven here. It just has to be six. Didn't I also miss the seven there? Just 
me being a little silly. This is 5, this is 6, this is 9, thanks to our 9, 6. Up here we still need 8 and 4. Only way to do that. Then, 8, 8, where is 8 going to go? This will be 7, this will be 5, this will be 8. 8, 6, 5, so this is 8, 7, this is 7, with, I guess, 5, 6, with the 8 here. 5, 6 gives us 7, then 4 and something, 4 and 8, we know the order, 4, 8, 4 gives us 3, 3 gives us 3, a bunch of 5, 6s running around everywhere, so who's going to fix the order for us? 5, 6, that doesn't fix the order still. 1, 4, 5, 6. One, and then six, four, five, six. I don't know what to do with that. Four, five, six. Ah, two, three, four. This becomes five, and that sets the order everywhere. Five, six, five, five, six. Hopefully, I didn't mix one of those up, but I guess I'll, I'll find that out soon enough. This is three, sorry, because of the seven, obviously. Then, what are we missing still? Across here, we need two and something, two and four. Uh, from the box, we're still missing five and seven. Five, seven. For the column, we need six and three. So this is three, six. Six gives us five, six. Five gives us five. And finally, we need, we need seven. And we are done in nine minutes and four seconds with XV German Whisper Sudoku by Clover. So, that was the first bonus puzzle of the gas leak. I hope you enjoy it. I'll see you for bonus puzzle number two. And thank you for watching.